Hey friends, my name is Z and you're watching Z Makes It Easy and welcome to a new video for Design Technology Timbers Call Content and today we have a new video which is 1.15 Investigate and analyze the work of professionals and companies to inform designs and by the end of the lesson you should be able to describe 1.15.1 which is analyzing a product to specification criteria or the specification so check out the pain comment for the timestamp to this sub-specification. But we move on now to 1.15.1, analyzing a product to specification criteria. Here we have the criteria, the definition, the description, and the considerations for a kettle design. So all these will be based around a kettle. And the form is basically the shape or appearance of the aesthetics of the product. And it's related to the size, proportion, weight, color, texture, and the tone of the product. And for a kettle, it could be the shape, the color, and the size. And for a function, it's what a product is intended to do. And it's basically how well it performs for the user. And for a kettle, it could be the ease of adding water, the ability to know that water is at a desired level, the filters impurities, and the power source. And for user requirements, it's basically how products will fulfill the wants and needs of users. And description is basically the need to know an uh, end user and may ask for preference. And for example, for a cancer, it could be weight, color, portability, and safety. And then performance requirement is the ability to, to complete a given task to a measurable standard. And for description, the product is the product is tested and evaluated to meet requirements such as the speed, distance, size, quality, and accuracy. And this could be a selling point, like miles per gallon of the sound output. Then for a kettle, it could be the capacity, the time to reach boiling point, and the length of extension cord. Then we have materials or, uh, and components or systems. And it's the best materials for making the product. And it depends on the purpose of the product and the user, the end user, and the type of manufacturer. And the choice of materials also depend on the cost, aesthetics, availability, and mechanical properties such as strength, hardness, weight, and heat resistance. And for a cancel, it could be heat insulation, strength requirements, cleanability, and corrosion resistance. And for the scale of production and cost, it's the quantity produced uh, and per, her per unit fixed cost to ensure an acceptable price and quality for customer. And it's basically the need to identify a number of units and production method based on demand. And the cost varies due to economics of scale. And bulk buying materials or using continuous production can save on cost. And materials and process used for kettle, production method, appropriate quality, and an ideal price. And for sustainability, it's basically the environmental impact of the product from, uh, from manufacturer to the end of user or the end of use. And it's basically the life cycle and recycle. And for a kettle, it could be the environmental impact of extraction or processing raw materials, manufacturing methods, lifetime power consumption, and disassembly. And lastly, we have aesthetics, which is how we interpret a product as being attractive or pleasing. And description should be it's related to the way we see, touch, hear, smell, or taste an object. And for a kettle, it could be the use of pleasing colors. It's smooth to touch and clear lines with rounded surfaces. And marketability is the ability of a product to be sold. And it's related to how easily a product will sell in relation to its com uh, competitors. For example, in a kettle, it could be correct pricing for quality, extra functionality, and it fits with the current trends. And lastly, we have a consideration of innovation and specifically how a company will look at new ideas and methods in design, pro design of products. And the description is that it, how the boundaries of technology are used to improve the design, manufacture, fe features, and functionality of products. For example, in the kettle, it could be like improved materials like lighter or stronger, advancing manufacturing methods, and exciting new features.
And that's it for this new 1.15 video for design technology core content. And I hope you guys found it useful and found it helpful. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe and comment down below if you have any questions or criticisms. And also check out my Instagram in the description for more daily content. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this and I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, stay safe and peace.